We have some good news tonight for a sick Perth father stuck in a Balinese hospital. Stephen Didman could be flown home to Australia as early as tomorrow after a deal was struck with the hospital over his massive medical bill. Perth father Stephen Didman and his family have had three weeks of medical hell, but today some hope. He is stabilising. He's in, he is awake now. Um, they still got him in the ICU. He's, as far as I'm aware, I think they've taken the breathing apparatus off him, which is a good sign. Stephen has been stuck in a Balinese hospital since an epidural caused him to go into cardiac arrest. He's been unable to leave until his massive medical bill is paid. The bill is in the tens of thousands of dollars and has been growing by the day. This afternoon, a deal was struck, the hospital accepting a large lump sum, followed by future ongoing payments. My dad and his, my brother's wife and a good friend of theirs living in Bali as well have all maxed out their credit cards to make the final payments to get him home because if he, he just needs to be here with his family, friends, everyone. But the fight isn't over once the hospital bill is cleared. The next hurdle, another bill of almost $50,000 to fly Stephen home. His own father, Geoffrey, using his life savings to make it happen. And if everything goes to plan, Stephen could be back in Perth tomorrow afternoon. He's not one person to make a big deal. So for this to be everyone fussing over him, he just wants it to end. He, he's not the kind of person who would ever ask for help. Stephen had been living with his family in Bali for the last two years. He didn't have travel insurance. A GoFundMe page set up to help Stephen has so far raised $25,000. His family say they're grateful for the support. Kelly Williams, Nine News.